Welcome to this product demonstration termination video of a Keystone Category 5 Enhanced Jack. When you receive your connector, it's going to be individually bagged, and the bag is going to have some components in it. The bag is a perforation down one side. You can go ahead and pull this off, dump this out. There are instructions on the back of the bag you can follow. These connectors are uh, very easy to terminate. You'll see that two colors are always constant. The uh, brown and the blue don't change. The green and the orange change depending on whether you're doing 568A or 568B. First process is going to be prepare your cable. So category 5E UTP cable. So using a cigar cutter style stripper, I'm going to do about two inches. I'm going to use the minimum spin so I don't cut too deep. I'm going to pull the rip cord off to one side and trim it. Don't need that. You take your connector body, you'll see the brown and the blue are constant, so you want to set your color codes up so they're going to the right side. So I got brown, blue, and then for 568B, I'm going to switch these so I have green and orange to get them in the right location. You don't have to untwist the pairs all the way to put them into the jack. I just want to give it a couple spins to uh, separate the pairs down near the base, get them in the right color code. Do both the uh, blue and the brown first because those are going to be the anchors. Ladies in here. All right, once all your pairs are laid in there, you can use a little 110 punch down tool or insertion tool to push them down all the way. Or if you feel you're comfortable with it, you can go ahead and crimp them in the tool. Tool has a couple features to it. You got this uh, latch to hold the tool shut. Sometimes that latch, if you don't anchor it, it will stop you from closing your tool. So you want to make sure it's properly latched up in this uh, little uh, cavity that holds it. It'll actually click in place. And then you go ahead and crimp your tool. So taking your connector, the keystone latches on the sides fit into the cavities on the tool. You got keystone latch cavities here. I'm going to go ahead and line this up, slide it all the way in. Make sure my blade's lined up. And then I can go ahead and crimp my tool. All my wires come off. Pull this out, double check, make sure everything's inserted correctly. Now I go ahead and pull my cable straight. Have the strain relief. I'm going to use it to cup the bottom part here and just tuck it in. It'll click in place. And my termination is complete.